everybody, it's me, Gabby again. Welcome back to my channel. Today it's going to be pretty different. It's going to be an unboxing video, which had quite a few. But this is a little bit different because it's fake shite. So, let's get into that. So I have a box here and I have my trusty scissors. And I already cut the tape, but let's just see. Okay, the Knox Dropper Stallion. The one that's retired actually. Let's see how good this horse is. These are all from China, so I'm curious to see the quality. They were about the same price as like regularly the real one, the real Schleich would be. Of course, there's no Schleich stamp under the belly. It looks like there's a hole. Like here, there's a little like hole thing. There. I don't know what that might be. But weight wise, like texture wise, he doesn't have the greatest, but I think the official one is actually the same. Uh, he doesn't smell bad. He doesn't smell like anything at all, actually, which is good. And I don't see any seams. So it's actually quite good quality. Um, I think the hair though should be a bit different, and this whole thing is weird, but other than that, he's really good, and he doesn't feel weird, and weight wise, he feels like this is actually his weight. Also his legs are not bendy, like they're not, and, wow, no. That's great. I wonder if he stands though. Let's see. Let's close his box that he came in and see if he'll stand or if he's tipsy. He stands solid. I mean, well, I mean, he's just a little bit tipsy, but you know, most of the actual horses are, so. This guy is pretty awesome. I'm very happy with the quality of this guy, knowing that he is not the real one, like the real thing. He's very good. It's the only place I could find him too, so. So I think they got it very well. They actually, they actually got it very, very well. So I technically have a retired horse, one of my grails, but it's not the real one. But yeah, Lucasano <laughs> Delvin. Let's see how good this one is. If the nap strapper was good, maybe this guy will be as good. Oh. Hmm, that's strange. This guy seemed shinier and really, really bad, like, yeah, you see, like, bigger, bigger seams and stuff. I mean, I can always sand that down. He smells good. Like, he smells, but he smells good. Like, perfume almost. And, hmm. He has, like, two black marks here. There's one here, and one here, and... Hmm. Wow. I think he's good, other than being, like, weirdly shiny. I don't know if the original's like that, because I've never seen him in person. But I guess I'll just sand down the seams and maybe repaint him. Uh, the final test I'm going to do with these guys, though, I'm going to water them. I'm going to put them in the water and see how good the paint stays on. That's one thing i got to do. Let's see if this guy stands up. And then we have one more horse in here, but let's see if this guy stands. Well, he stands very well, considering he's on three legs. Wow, he can't even stand like that. Wow. Yeah, he stands very well, and yeah, this guy, 9 out of 10 just because of his paint quality. So guys, this horse doesn't exist. I know that sounds very weird, but this horse doesn't exist. So, basically, okay, well, I was looking online at that website. I got these two, and then I was continuing to see if there was any other ones. Um, and as I was looking, I saw this one, I'm like, it doesn't exist. But the mold exists, but the color doesn't. They never made a color like this. It's a white Clydesdale building? 
I'm very confused by this. So let's open him up and see his quality. Just, they never made this horse. They never made it. Like, I don't know if it's a, some kind of exclusive. I don't think it is, because, like, why would they make the exclusive one? It's just kind of weird. But here she is. Wow. <laughs> and his quality, now you can really tell this guy, it seems like they just shaved off the lettering. It seems like he's really an actual schleich because the little herring is like just like the one that I have, the official one. Just not this, this color, obviously. His face is the same, his belly is the same, his hairdo is the same, obviously. As you can tell, you saw my Clydesdale um, in my haul video, so you can tell this one is the same horse. Like, remember how I was saying that the main, I like that they did that and this tail and stuff. But that's like the real Clydesdale look. So, this guy's really, really good. Just a few, like, marks, but I can paint over that. He's so good. Wow. Let's see if he stands, though. That's like the moment of truth. Hmm. Okay, so he's tipsiest out of all of them. Because this hoof is bent off the ground. Uh, but you know what? It doesn't look like he's... Like... First, from this side that I'm looking at, from like right now, like how I'm looking at him, it doesn't look like he's standing weird. It's clearly tipsy, but... It looks like he's standing normally, so I'm not bothered by that. But now let's go do the water test. I want to see how good their paint stays. So I did the water test, and this guy's paint stayed perfectly. I even like scrubbed him, and he's totally fine. Nothing came off of him. And this guy, obviously nothing came off of him, because the shiny gloss, like you can tell that nothing would happen to him. And the Nubs Jumper is also fine, so they're very, very good quality. I just think that the seams are shown a little more. Like, on this guy, it's fine. Uh, and on this guy, it's fine as well. He just has, like, a scratch thing here, like an indent almost, but I don't care because this is offside. Um, this guy does have lots of seams, like up here. And on his chest, but I'm just going to sand that and paint over or something. Or just, or just leave it, I don't know. But yeah, I just think that the seams are bad on him. But that's it. Other than that, the quality is really, really, really good. And I'm very amazed by that. Okay, guys. So thanks for watching. And yeah. Remember that fake schleich might not be that bad. So I would try it if I were you.